Okay. Okay, so hey guys, um, it's Bubbles. I am... I know, you guys are like, Bubbles, what the fuck happened to your hair? Oh my god. And I'm like, yeah. I cut it, got a mohawk. It was purple. And then my mom was like, oh my god! It's like getting like old lady purple and it like turned blonde and stuff and it looked really gross. And then we dyed this before school started. So, yeah. So, so this happened last week on Wednesday-ish. But I don't know. If you're watching this on like a later date, this happened, um, let me see. This happened August 14th. So, on August 14th, my hair was blueified. But anyways, off on on topic with my hair let's get back to what this video is actually about I know my webcam is stupid as usual but anyways we're going to do my candy collection after one year slash how I store all of it since I've gotten so much more since when I did my introduction and that's when I actually did my only other candy tour so this is gonna be everything is in a pile right here as you can see so yeah um i will also be making a video no well i'll put it into this video i'll just do like a little like cut thing and then i'll do a video of me um getting candied out <laughs> for no apparent reason because last night i was going to do this but i got grounded from the computer for so many reasons and yeah so we're just gonna do it right now. So, yeah, hold on. So, yeah. Anyways, let's begin. Candy collection after one year. I'm not doing this in any order. I grab what I grab and it'll just put it. Okay, so, first starters off, I have this gigantical tub that I got at Walmart for like two bucks. So let's stick on it, see. But I didn't get the clear lid, I got a blue lid all of this standing on so yeah so starting now I'm just gonna go over the stuff that I'm gonna put on candy yeah you're not going I'm gonna get your buggy. so I have this slinky that I might make a slinky cuff on later um a whistle you can't rave without the whistle guys <laughs> just kidding no People who rave with whistles are fucking annoying. Just, just, just saying. Just saying. I know so many people who hate that. And I have a Black Veil Brides pin. Let's see, this is Black Veil Brides BVB. I have um, a unicorn pin, and it says he's farting, and it says I make the magic happen. Sorry if you can't see that. Oh, there, there. And then, um. I have a perler. It's a frog. It wasn't a cuff, and then I took the cuff apart. No, it wasn't a cuff. I sent the cuff to somebody. I didn't want to send them this because my friend made it. So I took it off the cuff. And, yeah. Um, I have a Bulbasaur perler. My friend thinks it's Venusaur, but it's Bulbasaur. Um, yeah, I got this from Kaylee on Facebook. Okay, then, uh, I have this rubber ducky. I bought it at Target for like a dollar in the dollar section. Oh, and did you guys know that Target started selling beets? Yeah, I didn't know it either. Okay, so I think that was all the stuff that I have on candy. I might come across it. And yeah, well, this, okay, so, move your shit. Well, this Pinkie Pie was on candy, and then my dog chewed it up, so it's trash. Okay, so on to what, oh, these I got from uh, Love Girl 32. Okay, so, starting with the stuff that I made that I'm not going to trade away. Um, 
my troll doll epic. Uh, I still need to get the beads to put in. Oh, sorry, my camera's reversing me. So, shit. Sorry. Okay, so, I still need to get letter beads so I can put naked party across their chest. Shit. Okay, so this, this one is wearing a necklace with a B on it. It stands for Ben, which is Miwa. And then the D stands for Danny, which is one of, which is one of my pack sisters in my furry pack. Yes, I am as a furry. Don't judge me. And it's a random epic because my beads got all mixed up and stuff on the floor. So it's like, oh my god, I'm going to pick a random epic. And then, yeah. So yes, that is my child. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, uh, my camera keeps getting out of focus. I'm doing the big stuff first. So I have a smaller pile when I go. So, and then I have this really tall rainbow cuff that doesn't fit my wrist. I got this also from Love Girl 32. Um, so yeah. Uh, if they have a YouTube channel, I will be calling them by their YouTube name. And if they don't, I will just be say, stating their first name. So, viewer discretion and disclaimer. They, you will not know their last names. Unless Love Girl 32 has one of her videos where, yeah. Well, I got this from Love Girl 32. And then, um, I also got this from Love Girl 32 with the bunny single that says bunny. Bunny. And, yeah, it's really cute and soft and cuddly and lovable. And, uh, see, I'm doing, like, the big stuff. And then I also got this giraffe single from Love Girl 32. It's it's really cute. It's green and it says giraffe. If you can see this, all I know it says giraffe. Um, these two babies need names, cause I didn't know that. Like so, yeah, these babies need names. So yeah, if you know what you want, if like you think that you want to name, like I'm doing a contest for who's naming them. The winner will. Well, the winner will obviously, their names will be the winner's picks. So, write a comment for the buttonies names. One name per comment. And one comment per person about names. So, name a thingy about the bunny. So, leave a comment for the bunny. And leave a comment for the giraffe. And so, yeah. The winner's names will be named to my two babies because we didn't name them they're just right now they're just bunny and giraffe and they need names because all my candy has all my candy that has like stuffed animals characters on it have a name so those two need names is that a single oh no it's a duck is that a single oh it's a giraffe um a kerber it's not on anything um I got this at the thrift store for like 57 cents. It's really cute and soft. I might put it on an epic. But yeah. I might put it on the epic that I'm sending um, Ninny Candy Kitty in the collab. Because I can't find a stuffed bunny anywhere that I go. So yeah, I might just send her the Care Bear. Put the Care Bear on the epic that I'm sending her. Um. This thing, you guys all know what this is if you watched one of my other videos, that's never going to get finished because, yeah, because I decided, no, if they really want to know, they can message me on Facebook and I will tell them what to do because I'm lazy and I don't really want to finish this. Um, yeah, the other channel actually isn't happening anymore. I forgot the password and stuff and yeah, I might just, I might do a branch off of Candy Corner. I might start my own YouTube channel for candy stuff, and I might finish it on that channel, or I might just cut it and restart it because it's falling apart anyways. So yeah, that's that's that. And I'm just doing my cuffs and stuff first. Got this from Kaylee on Facebook. It's green and clear beads that are in the diagonal. It's really cute. I love it. I like wear it sometimes. I don't wear a lot of my stuff all the time. And this was supposed to be another. Well, this is 
I was supposed to remake the vortex cuff for a trade because it was too small for her wrist. And then, yeah, I then, then we canceled our trade because she couldn't, because she was on vacation and stuff. And then, yeah, we didn't, we stopped talking after she got back. So yeah, I just have this cup that I'm sending to my rave mom. So yeah, it's made out of five millimeter string and it's not very stretchy because it's super duper tight. Well, it stretches, it just doesn't stretch. And then, um, my Jeffree Star single cuff that I got from the, from Lizzie on face Elizabeth on Facebook. She's awesomeness and awesome, yeah. We have to, we have really awesome conversations about Amanda Todd. Don't hate on me because I diss on Amanda Todd. You all know that it was her fault. Anyways, yeah. Lizzie sent this to me. I love it. Um... What's another big thing? Oh, okay, so, uh, this is, I don't, it's either a teddy bear or a panda bear. I don't, I'm not sure. Because when I first got it, I opened it like this, and I really didn't know what it was. I was like, what is this girl? And my mom just flipped it over, and she's like, oh, it's a bear. I was like, oh. So, yeah, this one also came from Kaylee. Uh, on Facebook and it's awesome it's cute and my friends always like let me have that one let me have that one I'm like no you can not have it cuz Kaylee gave this to me and they're like why can't I have it I'm like because a friend gave it to me dude excuse my lazy eye it really it gets in the way a lot sorry and then this one I just got yesterday in the mail from Kayla I can't remember her YouTube channel so I'm just gonna say Kayla so yeah, it's um a paint. It's a purple, red, and yellow zig uh, diagonal cup, and it comes with a. It came. She put a 3D mushroom on it. It's really cute. My mom thought it was a cupcake at first. Um, Ginger Madison has a tutorial on 3D mushroom. Oh shit! I mean, Ginger Candy has a tutorial on how to make a 3D mushroom on her channel. So go check it out if you want to learn how to make this. Not the cuff, the the mushroom. Um, and then I also got this cuff from Kayla. It's really beautiful. I love it so much. I was like, oh my gosh. So yeah, I didn't make a trade unbox. I don't want to make trade unboxing videos anymore because I don't know. I just don't really feel complied to do it so I'm not going to anymore and what the fuck happened to you oh sorry <laughs> oh my god dude what happened to your hair I don't know what happened to this dude's hair I might I don't know he got wet at Elish's so yeah um this is my troll doll cage cuff um I made this because I effing love troll dolls. I still need to get letter beads so I can put love across his chest. And so yeah, this is my love doll troll. This is my love troll. He's cute. He, his pink hair, he's wearing some outfit, and he's carrying a heart. It's really cute. It's a cat, so cat, so cat. And uh, what about uh, shit? Um, is that all the big stuff? Holy poof. Okay, wait, no, last thing, last, last, like, thing, well, this is the last thing I've made in this pile that I might not trade away. Um, it's my all-star, well, Candy's all-star bracelet, uh, cuff, um, I'm not going to be making a tutorial on this, Cellular Mango and Ginger Candy have one, because the Cellular Mango is back, bitches, and yeah. I made this one night when I was bored, thinking I was going to do something else with the stars, but I'm like, oh, let's just make a candy all-star, and then I'm like, yeah. Or you can, like, wear it as an all-star bracelet, or you can wear it as a crown. I know you can't see it on my head, but you can wear it as a crown. Ginger made one, and she wore it as a crown for a rave. And so, yeah. Go check out G Cellular Mangoes or Ginger Candy's tutorial on this. And yeah. It's awesome. Sorry. Um, no, I'll show this first. Um, 
This is um, an X, a, a 1X base with like this flower button on it and a bell for my rave mom because she loves bells. And like we were in a tiny chat session one night and I was like, Coco, I'm going to make this for you. And she's like, what is it? I'm like, it's a one, it's an X space with a bell on it. She's like, oh my God, I love you forever. And so yeah, I made that for her. It's fun to play with when you're bored. I do it all the time in school and I get in trouble for it, but oh well. <laughs> Anyways, and then I also got this from Kayla. It's a double one X space. So instead of using one bead, she used two beads for each. See, so it goes one, two, instead of just one, shit, where's my finger? So it goes one, two, instead of going one, and then the center bead, the connector bead. So, it doesn't stay like this when it's not on your wrist. It, like, goes flat. So it looks like you made a 3D. So, yeah, it's very beautiful. Um, if you want to learn how to make this, just... Just double the beads on when you're making your X base, and hopefully that was good. So yeah, that was that. And then um, I'm showing all the cuffs. I got this from Emily on Face. Different. Um, you may know her. She's a big. She started. She just started. Well, she's been making candy, but it wasn't candy. So this is. Yeah, she made this, and we traded it at a bowling alley when we went. It was really fun. Rainbow Fatty that I'm working on for Emily on Facebook. Because she made me a bunny 3D. It was really cute, but my dog chewed it up. <laughs> Bitch. Oh no, there's, one, there's another cuff. Um, a Hello Kitty cuff that I made for Love Girl 32 for our trade that I still need to get done and send out and stuff. Um, it doesn't have whiskers because I was lazy and I didn't add the whiskers because I was like, oh, hell, doesn't know this is getting too fucking complicated. So I was just like, oh, yeah. So, yeah. That was, this is the first pattern cuff that I've ever made. So feel, feel, feel proud, bitches. That took me, like, an hour. Okay, it's bad. Okay, so, um, this is a 3D star that I got from Kayla on Facebook. I can't remember her YouTube channel. And yeah, Cellular Mango has a tutorial on 3D stars. If you want to learn how to make one, go check out her tutorial on that. And then, um, oh, I forgot to show this. This is the, oh God, it broke. It's broken, guys. Guys, it is broken. I repeat, my rainbow badge is broken. But anyways, this is a rainbow badge from Pokemon. It looks sexy, doesn't it? I made this. Thank you, Crumpet, for making the pattern. Um, it's broken. I'm kind of depressed now. But anyway, thank you, Crumpet, for making the pattern. Um, yeah. So, yeah. And then uh, I got this I made off of a pattern that her name, Rachel, she's one of the girls in the collab. Um, is she still in the collab? I'm not sure. And it's Pac-Man Ghost Love. Um, she's, she made one on a necklace. And it was really cool looking, so I'm like, hey, I'm gonna, ma I messaged, I made one, I made this, and then when me and my ex-girlfriend were still dating, I didn't cut it up because it's so cute and I love it and I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I might hang it on my wall. This was supposed, the, the green one is me and the blue one is like her, I guess, but it's, the green one and the blue one are nobody at the moment because I don't, I'm not currently dating anyone. So, yeah, this is, I made this when we were dating. It's really cute and kawaii, and yeah, with kawaii stuff. Okay, on to necklaces. Oh, no, 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 this is the last peyote thing, I think. Yes. Um, I made this candy paw print for my, for my rave mom, because she's also my furry den mother. She's also my furry mom. So I made this for her. It was all originally fishing line, and then it kept breaking, so I just did the upper part and stretchy string because the bottom part didn't break. So yeah. Okay, on to necklaces. Um, this is my first big peyote thing. It's brass knuckles. Um, Ocean Rose, thank you for making a tutorial on it. Um, she's a YouTuber. She's pretty legit and stuff because she's awesome. So yeah, I made this. Um, it's 
not for trade. I promised it to somebody. So yeah. And then I made this bubbles necklace with. Say, I made the bubbles in here too, so it's all sexy and good and messy. Sexy, fun, and fierce, and now you're at it. I got whoa. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, that. There's that. Um, I made the bubbles in here. Um, I didn't use a recipe. I just know from my experience and stuff. So, and then the beads are just random. A whole bunch of beads. Purple beads. And a little bit, few black ones that I got from a friend's mom. No, my cousin's mom. Sorry. And then, my all-time favoriteest necklace in the world I got from Emily. Um, it has a little teacup on it. And it's, it's pink beads and um, pearly pink, pinkish pastel white, pastel pink pearl, pearly pink pastel beads. And it says, tea party. Um, what the hell? It says tea party. And it's my favorite necklace um, because, it, I don't know, because I can just like sit there and like be like a bitch and sip on my tea at rate. Not really. I'm not going to put tea in that. It's too tiny, girl. I'm just joking. And then this bubble necklace that I got from Emily. It's amazing. I don't wear it anymore because it has a hole in it and I don't want the bubbles to leak out. If, like, I ever do wear it again, it just might be to, like, rave and stuff. I don't wear it at school because I got it taken away because it was a distraction. But I don't see how. I wasn't even doing anything with it. I was chewing on it. And now that's not how the hole is there. And then I got this. I made this. This isn't for trade because I got this from Lizzie on Facebook. Elizabeth on Facebook. I made the necklace though, and it has a, a star, a heart, and two like really big ass yellow beads. Like, look at how big these things are compared to normal pony beads. And yeah, and it says epic right here. Well, my camera's reversing everything, so yeah. It's an epic face. I got that from Lizzie. It's not betrayed. Um, and then uh, um, I got this. This was Emily's first candy mustache necklace. It's a little wonky and stuff, but I still love it to death. Thank you, Emily. If it breaks, I'm gonna be really sad. That's why I don't wear it as often because it was me who made the necklace look. <laughs> oh well. Thank you, Emily, for this. I love it. I don't wear it as often as I used to. And then, hold on, let me, like, fix this because she sent this to me and I got all crushed and stuff in the mail. Um, I got, I also got this from Love Girl 32 It's a 3D star necklace. Um, yeah, I love it. It's rainbow and it's a 3D star. Some of it glows in the dark. I really love it. It's beautiful. Thank you, Love Girl. Um, other necklace. A Furby necklace. Oh, yeah. Furbies are fucking awesome. And it vibrates. When you pull its tail out. This is for a friend on Facebook because she made me a Dora necklace that says, Hey, motherfuckers, is Dora. So, yeah. And that is very awesome of her. She did not have to do this. Well, she, I asked her to because she went to the thrift store and I saw Dora. And I was like, Oh my God, will you make me this necklace? And she's like, Yeah, what do you. I'm like, What do you want for it? And she's like, Oh, just a necklace. I'm like, Okay, and then I made this. It's really long. It's like <laughs> really long. I wasn't intending on it to be this long, but it was. It came out this long. And then, okay, I think this is my last necklace that I have. Yeah. Um, this came from, also came from Kaylee on Facebook. Um, it's a pig, it's, her name is Bumblebee. I named her Bumblebee. Well, my, fr my friend Natasha, before she moved, named her Bumblebee. Because she has a bumblebee as a cutie mark. And yeah, she's really cute with a Pinkie Pie recolor. <sighs> um, 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 oh, this is not done. It's supposed to be said. It's a Pikachu Sprite. And this is my Fluttershy. This is my unicorn Fluttershy. Because, yeah. Because... Yeah, the girl who made this tutorial on YouTube was so confusing. Like, I did not know what she was saying. She was like, first you gotta do this, and then you gotta do this, and then you gotta do this, and then you gotta do this. And I was like, oh, M, G, bitch, shut the fuck up. 
And then she was like, then you gotta do this. And then she made like the pa like the tutorial like freaking three videos long and she could have gotten it done in one minute if she wouldn't stop goofing around and stuff. But yeah, I made this from a girl's tutorial. It came out really good. I love it. It, I don't know. Like, yeah. Thank you, girl, who made the tutorial. I don't know your YouTube name. We're not subscribed to you. Just kidding. I'm not mean. I'm not a mean person. Um, I think that was every- Oh, no. My peyote thing that's breaking. That I can't wear. Um, my first star cuff that Emily gave me, it's breaking, so I don't wear it. And, yeah, I don't wear candy once it's broken. I don't remake candy once it's broken due to, like, sentimental values and stuff and such. But I've only remade like one thing that I've gotten and it's because it broke right away and I found all of the beads and she sent me a little bit of stripe. So yeah. Well I made it a little bit bigger so it would fit on me. And it, Anyways, um, I made this thing, I don't know what to call it, it's supposed to be a candy chain bracelet. It was on my furry collar that I made and I don't know where that furry collar is. I don't like it, it's too small. I might cut it and just use the beads for something else. It's like a whole bunch of blue and black beads. And so yeah, it's a chain bracelet that I don't wear as much because it's too fucking big. Um, a bow bracelet that has three singles attached to the bow. I got it from Emily, on the same Emily, and it says bow tie on it. The beads and stuff are all like fading and gross and stuff. But yeah, I wear that like all the time though. So that's probably why. <laughs> Anyways, and then I got this from Kayla and it says, Schlitterbahn water parks. It's it's metal. It's really beautiful. I like love it. I haven't had a chance to like wear anything that she's sent me as of late because I didn't. I made I put I put on all my candy and stuff last night and yeah stuff happened and I cried and yeah better not get into that because this isn't counseling. Um, my first actual single that I made. That was meant to be candy. It's a glow-in-the-dark bead that I stole from my friend, and it says Ben. It's really beautiful. Um, I'm not trading that for certain reasons, because it has a name on it. And I'll pass it down to another awesome Ben, like a Ben. Who's a Ben? Anyways, this is my first, like, really tiny-ass Saturn cuff. Um, it doesn't even... It fits on me. See, it's just all stretched out and stuff. But anyways, yeah. I made that when I was bored out of a piece of string when I was running out really low on beads. So I made this. It's very beautiful, isn't it? Um, Ginger Candy has a tutorial on Saturn. A uh, Saturn cuff. So go check hers out. This one I got from my first trade. Um, you might have seen it, but it says Seahawks. I had to remake it because it broke. Um, really horribly. And so yeah, and it says Seahawks, and I found all the beads, and yeah, I, this is before I stopped remaking everything that breaks. Not a lot of things that I've I've received have broken on me, but yeah. Anyways, yeah, I got that. <laughs> it's beautiful, and it says I got this really cute ninja perler single. He's blushing if you can't see. Oh, well, yep, you can see. And it says Datsma Ninja. It's supposed to say that's my ninja, but instead of saying that's my ninja in beads, she put that's my peyote ninja. So it's that's my ninja. Sorry for saying that so many times. Yeah, I got this from Kate on Facebook. I got uh, this. Also, I got this from Kayla. It's really cute. It's a baby safety pin bead thing. It's really cute. Oh, my favorite. One of my favorite singles. It uh, has some really cool glass beads on it. Thank you for that, Kayla. It's really cool. And it says funny shit. <laughs> oh, wow. My webcam's not reversing things. Yeah, it says funny shit. Um, yeah, I love it. Thank you, Kayla. This one I made for my friend Mariah last year. I kept forgetting to give it to her, but I'll give it to her this year around her birthday time as a birthday present. See, it says Mariah. Um, yeah, you know, she's not a candy kid, but she kept asking me to make her a bracelet for her birthday, and I said, okay, I will. And then I did, and I just, and I said, oh my gosh, I keep forgetting at home. So this one, I got from Lauren on Facebook. It's very bodomous. This one, I got from Kayla. 
on Facebook. It's very cool. It has glow in the dark hearts on it and it's blue and green and yeah. This one I got from Kayla. It's very voluminous colors and it has a foam heart on it. That's very beautiful and it's sparkly and glittery and I think love sparkles and glitters. Sorry I'm talking like that. I'm just like la la la. This video is really long. So please, please don't click away at this point. There's not that much left. I promise you. This is my Ghetto Hipster Angel Dora single. It's blue and white. Um, Emily on Facebook, she has a devil one. And that's her devil angel. Her, that's her devil angel Ghetto Hipster Dora. And that's what we call them because it looks the, the girl looks like Dora. So yeah. But Dora's not white. Dora's a Mexican. <laughs> but yeah. Um, I also got this from Kate on Facebook. It has a really sexy watermelon on it. And it's red, black, green, and white. It's very beautiful. It has a watermelon on it. Oh, I got this one from Kate on Facebook, too. It has, like, this green squishy thing on it. It's really fun to play with. And it has, like, really cool dark beads on it. I don't know where she got them. They're very cool, though. So, yeah. Sorry that's not, like, all laid out on the floor so you can see all of it. I'm just showing you each individual piece because I'm lazy and I don't have a lot of room on my computer room floor. So, yeah. And then, anyway, so, yeah. She gave me some of that. And then... Oh, I, do, I didn't. I forgot this necklace. Um, it's my light up pacifier. Um, a lot of ravers and such are against using pacifiers because it has a lot of drug paraphernalia and a lot of drug relate relations to it. That's why I'm like, if I ever do wear it to a rave, I'm not going to be like sucking on it and stuff. It'll just be sitting there on my neck. And before I do anything with it, I'm going to change the string because it's really ratchet and ghetto because I bought it at Spencer's. But yeah. That's that shit. Holy shit. And um, this single um, I also got from Lauren on Facebook. She's pretty awesome. She was like very patient with me sending her package. Thank you for that. That was like a long time ago though, so don't worry about it, guys. Um, I got this one for Kayla too. It has a rocky horse on it. It has um, cool like bead things. It has a, a giraffe and a rhinoceros on it, and it's really cute, and it's very awesomeness. Ooh, I don't know how to pronounce this, but she gave this to me. It has pink, purple neon beads and blue and white glow in the dark beads and it says Gorgas G-O-R-G 3 U-S or G it's a, I think the 3 is supposed to be an E maybe she ran out of E's cause you know candy problems never enough E <laughs> just kidding <laughs> sorry I cracked myself up anyways yes I am so lazy, I don't want to go through the rest of this, but I have to. <sighs> Awkward face. Anyways. Um, my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle single. You can tell because it's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle single. I made it a little bit too big. Um, the idea came from a girl at my church when we had this thing called a 30 hour famine. And she had one that looked exactly like it, so I decided to try and remake it, and it came out a little bit too big. But yeah, she's not a candy kid. She just really likes making singles and stuff. Um, her, I have her single in here somewhere. I might have showed it already. I'm not sure. But if I haven't, yeah, she made me a single. And if not in here, if I haven't showed it, I don't know where it might would have been, would have went. But anyways, yes. Oh, wow, I didn't know that bead had glitter in it. But anyways, this is a Pokemon card single that I'm never going to trade away. Because obvious reasons, it's blue. And I am a blue kid. And it has a whole bunch of blue beads on it. Except this yellow bead, because it's a hipster and it doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> anyways, um, and this one, it's an awesome rainbow one. And it came from Love Girl 32 and it says... Rainbow Cake. Cause I think her name, her rave name, I think is Rainbow Cake. So she go, she gave it to me, and it goes, 
She sent me a single that goes all the way up to here because, um, hold on, I'll show it next. Um, yeah, so it says Rainbow Cake and it's rainbow, it's really cool. Um, because this single that she made me, it goes all the way up to like here on her, ish. So yeah, I really love it. It's says Bubbles and it's awesome. Thank you, Rainbow Cake. Um, I have a little bit of more of your stuff that I'm think I have that I can show? Yes, I am. So, anyways, uh, the single, it was, it's used with that cool fabric string and stuff, and it says, hugs, not drugs. But my mom thought it said drugs, not hugs, so she got mad. But, but then I said, read it closely, and it's just like, oh. So, yeah. Um, this one I got from Kayla also. It's two singles attached by the speed. It's really cool. It's not glass. It's plastic, and it's painted. But it's really beautiful. I like it. I like the bead. I thought it was real. And that's all that matters, right? If people think it's real. But anyways, yeah. I got that from Kayla. Um, I oh do. This video is getting so long. I think I m might just make me suiting up in my candy a different video because of the time consumption that it takes. And this video is already probably like an hour fucking long. And I know a lot of you don't want to listen to that because I don't. Yeah. Anyways, I got this from my friend, my rave daughter, Techno Kitty. And it says Raver. It's awesome. It was one of my first trades that I've ever done. And yeah, it's not stretchy. It's used with really cool, like, lanyard string. That's tubity. Neon single that I got from Kaylee. Um, Halloween single I got from Lauren. To write love on her wrist single that I got from um, uh, Kaylee. I think this says bat. I'm not sure. I got it from Kayla. It's really cool. I like it a lot. Um, a star single with glow in the dark beads on it, and it's supposed to say Mickey. It just got really like rubbed off and stuff. I think I might paint over it with nail polish. I'm not sure, or I'll just leave it so the vibes and stuff. Um, this isn't candy, but I got this from my brother when they went, from him and his wife when they went to the Cayman Islands. It's rasta colored and it says Cayman Islands on it. It's really cool. I don't wear it that much because it falls off my wrist. Um, Plur single that I got from Lizzie on Facebook. Elizabeth on Facebook, anyways. Um, Rainbow Star single that I got from Emily on Facebook. The same one who made, made me all the other stuff. Um, Pat... Pat, Matt beads that I but shit was this, I can't remember it's either Kaylee or Lauren because they both sent me a lot of singles so no this was this was Lauren this was no Kaylee this was Kaylee okay no Lauren I don't know it's one of the two I just can't remember um star that I got from Lauren um this one came from Lauren it's um a random bee it's random beads and stuff. I really like it. It's a chaos single. Um, rainbow single that I made for my sister for her birthday that I haven't seen because she's a lesbian. And yeah. So I thought I might make her a single so she could show her some, pride, show some more pride. Because that's pride is awesome. And yeah. And then I made a bisexual one for me. But then my cousin Monique dyed my hair. She's the one who did it purple at the first. She bleached it and she shaved it. And she did everything to it before it was this. So the sides were, yeah. So the bisexual one I gave to her be, in, as her payment for dyeing my hair. Um, this is the Dat Asta single that I made for Rainbow. I mean, for Love Girl 32. And yeah, it's very awesome and random. It is a very beautiful. I will show the one that she made me in a second. Um, a ring, a pony, a pony. I'm not going to show, I'm just going to show all the ponies at once because I'm really lazy. Ponies. <laughs> if you didn't see, I'm too bad. I'm half of a 3D star. The other half of a 3D star? Um, single that I got from Kate on Facebook, it has an eraser on it and it says smile. So like a little like weird and teared and stuff, but it says smile. You can still tell in person um uh glow in the dark star bracelet that I got from my rave daughter techno kitten 
it has a star on it. They used to, the base used to be silver, but I wore it so much when I first got it. It was like, well, um, this this one used to be silver and shiny, silverish red, but it got all wearing and gross because I wore it all the time. Star. Star. Um, popper thing. But I'm not gonna put on candy because it has a football on it, and I fucking hate football, and I don't want anybody else to have something that I fucking hate because I don't want the badass vibes in the candy. Um. Anyway. Um. Princess. Uh. It. It has a candy heart on it. I made it for my girlfriend when we were still dating. It has a whole bunch of random beads. It has a giraffe on it. It's a purple rhino. It has a, a charm on it that says princess, if you can read that. And then, yeah. Everything else is purple beads. Um, oh, shit. I forgot about these. Um, purple single that I made. Um, nasty ass three star thing. Well, it was supposed to be half of a three star, but I got all ratchet and shit, so now it just looks like this. But anyways, yeah, that was... Yeah, I made that. Um really cool single that I got from Kaylee. It has like cool like tube bead things on it and it's really cool. I like it. Um, yeah. It's sexy as fuck. No, it's sexual as fuck. I don't know. I talk about right shit like really awkwardly. Sorry. I'm sorry that you have to sit through this guys. I'm like apologizing in advance because I don't want to make this two parts because I'm lazy as fuck. Anyways, um, thinking I'm not, I'm not gonna put on candy for because it's sports and I don't really like sports. Um, it's the single that I got from Kayla. Um, it has a whole bunch of rocking chairs on it. It's really cool and it says XX on it. I don't know what it stands for. Um, I don't want to ask her, but it's very Budimessy. A uh, rocking horses are like rocking. It's like wah wah wah. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, that's that. Um, a bubble single that I got from Kaylee, as on Facebook as well. Um, it has a heartbeat on it. It's very cute. And then um, uh, white and shit, white and glow in the dark beads. Single. It has white stars on it. It's supposed to like represent the night sky and stuff. It's really beautiful when it glows in the dark though. Um, I got that from Lauren. Where's that really ratchet ass single that I don't remember making? Um, yes, this is a really ratchet single that I don't ever remember making or receiving from somebody in a trade. Oh wait, 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 figured I think I figured out what it was for. I made a heart thing and my dog chewed it up. That's what it was. My dog chewed up my 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 heart thing that I made, but it turned into a single and it's really ratchet and shit. And yeah, I might just send it to somebody to get rid of it because I don't want it. It's ugly and well, there's no such thing as ugly candy. I just don't like it because it wasn't ever represented to be a single, so it's ugly. I might or I might cut it and use the beads for something that I do with a lot of the candies that I don't ever remember making or receiving. Um, another rape was so. Anyways, yeah. Anyway, don't rave with whistles, kids. You're gonna beat the fuck up. And then this says flex. This single it says flex pavilion. Shit, I gotta put this down. Okay. Anyways, um, this single it says flex pavilion. I got it from Li Elizabeth on Facebook. Um. This rainbow single that I got from Emily on Facebook. And then this, no, it was gr shiny green and shiny blue. Not like, it was like silver, like shiny. And now it's all like ratchet and shit and I love it because it's like, yeah, it's beautiful. And I love it. I don't like ever, I don't ever wear it because I'm afraid they might break now that they're so like stretched out and stuff. Anyway, um, rainbow single that I got from my rave daughter, Techno Kitten, on Facebook. Her name is, uh, shit. Shit. Um, K. K, K, K. Hold on. Let me see. Sorry. Um, K. Shit. A. B. C. D. 
E. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, her name is Zoe. Zoe. And then I got this cool. It's all glow in the dark. It has like circle beads and normal beads and stars and stuff. And yeah, it's like really stretchy. Um, I got this from. Lauren on Facebook. Um, a peony mushroom that uh, Emily Cooper. Well, no, I made this at Emily Cooper's house when we, me and her, had a candy session. She made one too. Um, and then, yeah, this is the thing that I'm never gonna trade away because it was my first legitimate candy session ever, and it's very budimus. And I'm going to put it on something. And no, you cannot have it. Um. Uh, I don't know. I call it my Green Lantern single. I don't know why. Don't judge. It's, yeah. I got this from Lauren. Uh, the York Rainbow single that I got from Emily. Um, the Dadass Doe single that I got from, from, from Love Girl 32. I made it a little bit bigger so I could wear it because it was like, It was like this when I got it, and I didn't want to break it. Well, it broke, so I remade it, and yeah. Um, Mask of Misers. And my strong. I put those in there. No, I don't. Just kidding. Just go. And then ran about a shape that I had. Yeah. I have some more parties and stuff. Um, yeah, anyways. Um, that other video will be posted later. Because I have to finish editing and uploading this one. If you're re watching this, and it's probably already uploaded because this, yeah, if you're watching this in the future, it's already uploaded, silly, so go watch it. Because watching me suit up for candy is like amazing. Psh, girl, girl, yeah, no. So uh, <clears throat> if, if you're watching this and the video isn't uploaded, good for you. Good for you, bitch. And then if it's not uploaded, well, if it is uploaded, good. Good. Yeah, so. Mm, peace. And no, I have not weighed all of my candy. This is what it looks like when it's in the bucket. See, I'm in need of getting a new bucket real soon once I get more candy. Anyways, yeah, yeah this is a lid. It's awesome because it's blue and shit. And so yeah, that's, thank you for watching my candy collection video after uno year. Well, it's a little bit over a year because one, my, one year I was really busy and I really didn't want to make a video about it because I don't know, because I thought it was none of your fucking business. But I'm like, oh my God, no way. And so yeah, I'm, I'm sorry that I cuss a lot in my videos. Um, that's going to stop once I start my other YouTube channel. Because I don't, because I want younger viewers to watch my videos, and I know a lot of younger viewers don't really like, or don't know how to cuss, so, well, don't know what cussing is, so I promise I will stop cussing in my next and final after videos after this, because I don't want younger videos to go around cussing and saying that it was my fault and then getting hate messages on the channel for me it's from f directed towards my my part of the collaboration so yeah um anyway so yeah um be sure to like rate and comment and share with your friends um i don't do youtube trades just just fyi I only do mail trades and I'm going to stop doing mail trades after a while be soon because I am like blah and school is starting so after I trade with Ninny Candy Kitty send out Rachel send out Love Girl 32's package and send out um, Jennifer's package those are the only those are the only three mail trades that I will do that I am going to finish and no wait no I have to I don't know I'll have to ask her but my it's either three or, after the last four trades that I have um, I'm not going to be open for mail trades for a while because of lack of money time because school started and I don't really 
yeah, I don't want to feel too overwhelmed because last year I failed like three classes because of candy and I don't want that to revolve around my life again and yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. So, bye.